In this video, we'll present to you the different reports we have for parts list for the electrical discipline. But first, if we go to these two sockets for the circuit number three, I will include a group indicator by inserting the load for each socket. So I have here 600 watts, type it, and I will click on this socket. Now press enter, and instead of 600, we'll insert like 450 and W for the watts, okay? Click on this socket. Now, to generate a parts list, we come to the function create parts list. This message uh, tells me that I have some layers turned off in my model and they will not be part in the parts list report, okay? So I'll click OK and this is the preview of the parts list. If you just want to, to generate a text file report, you click on the editor button. Okay, You can also include uh, uh, categories or sort these components by categories. To do so, we, we use the option structure and we can create insert sortings. So filter by story area, rooms or any of uh, any one of these options here. Okay, But uh, I will focus this demonstration uh, by creating a report. So I come to the reports button and um, let me maximize. Let's start by the beginning. We, we can use this parts list option and then we have the options in the bottom left. The first parts list, let's go to the next page. This option parts list creates the, the report by category. So we have these main categories in both. Okay? We can also create a parts list uh, with the components sorted by room. So this option parts list per room. We go to the next page and we see here the components that belong to, to each room. Okay? We can also generate reports specific for the electrical discipline such as the cable list. In the bottom left, I will activate these three options and then go to the next page. This, this information uh, showing the circuit and cable um, number, the product number, product description, the length of the cable for each circuit. Also below, we see here the cable type, the distribution board it belongs, the room it belongs, the identification, the, the room description and also the length. We can also generate the electrical circuit load. Let me activate the show cable length option in the bottom left and if we go to the next page we see here uh, the component and on the power column we see here the load I have inserted for, uh, for each socket with the group indicator uh, function. When we talk about lighting circuits, it includes the load for each lamp. And in the bottom, we see here the total power. All these reports can be exported to PDF file and also other formats by coming to this export option.